going guys? So today I was on the internet like you do and uh, trying to find out just some ideas for what's going on tonight in Albuquerque so I can take my lady on a weekly date night and uh, came across this just calendar of events type uh, website and it was actually K-O-A-T. Seven, child 13, one of those. Anyway, and I saw this this thing at Hollowed Spirits Distillery in Albuquerque on First Street, and it was called So Far Sounds, right? And so I, I clicked on the link and went to go check it out, and it turns out it's this like last minute secret by invitation only concert and small venue and it seemed really cool so I sent Jocelyn a text saying hey are you interested in something like this and she said sure but she does and um, so I sent in my application for an invitation and uh, we got picked to go and uh, it, it did have a cost it was $15 a, a person but um, it's just an interesting premise because then once they pick you um, you get the choice to, to buy the tickets and tell them that you're going to be there. They send you the address of the venue and uh, they still don't tell you who's playing. So, uh, it's, it's neat. Um, so we went. We ended up going and we had a good time. <laughs> I, I had a good time. So. I had a great time. It was a lot of fun. I love music. Um, I am not a huge fan of like large concerts with lights and screaming people and uh, just people. I'm not, I love people, but not in, you know, large people groups. People in moderation. <laughs> I like people in Offers moderation. In moderation. <laughs> um. People in alcohol. <laughs> in bite-sized pieces. Right. Um, but, uh... So I don't like big concerts, but I do love small live music. Right. And um, this was great. This was really great. So it was, it was lots three of fun. bands, thirty to forty-five minutes each band, I think. Yeah, they did roughly all did around six to seven songs, something like that. Yeah. And um, what was neat about it, and that just kind of really why I wanted to, to showcase it on our our, uh, our channel is that tonight was their first So Far Sounds in Albuquerque. Right. And they have, every month from now, they'll have shows. So, um, if you're looking for something to do, we'll uh, put the dates nights. down in the description. That way, Plan you know what's going once on. a month until right. April. Right, so she has February, March, April. or just March and April. But there was a one for February. There is one for February. Is there? There sure is. Oh, that's right, we're going to be out of town. We're going to be out of town. <laughs> Which is something that's coming up on the channel, so be on the lookout for that. I love how you just delete it, like it's from existence. Oh, we can't go, it's not happening. <laughs> well, when you say we could go to the March one or the April one, I'm like, okay, there's not one for February, so uh, it's not that it. No, or I guess I didn't know, because anyway. I just assumed there wasn't a February one. Um, but no, we're gonna be out of town. Um, so this was the first one that they were having here in Albuquerque. And they have some more already planned through April. And uh, it's tons of fun, guys. So if that's something that you're into, live music, small venue, um, on their website they recommended uh, like floor seating and uh, so it's that kind of vibe uh, where we were at tonight there was chairs available so everybody was able to sit in the chair but I think that's the type of vibe that they're going for is just kind of like, like a backyard concert yeah backyard concert as a matter of fact part of their website I was reading it they have house venues where that's why they they keep the venue secret because if it's at somebody's house they don't really want to to everybody who goes to the website but those who are invited. Right. Um, another trick that I did find out about it though is if you get the app 
you don't have to request an invite, you could just buy tickets directly if they're not sold out. So, another thing about the So Far Sounds that I've noticed on their website is um, they're like worldwide so far. So like they have them in all over the place anyway. Not just in the States, but uh, other places too. <laughs> yeah. Worldwide so far. Worldwide They'll branch out right. to the universe later. Right. Yeah. Star Force, you know. <laughs> like you do. So here's some highlights from our night tonight. We took some video there and uh, we will also be posting the in the description the names of the bands and the, their websites and stuff and where you can find their music. I just loved her. She was awesome. She's from um, northern New Mexico. She's from northern New Mexico. Her yeah, name is Lara, yet. and she's awesome. Right. She, I mean, the, the other bands and the other guy, they were also awesome, but she was next level. No, Maybe that's was. just, you know, my whole New Mexico true speaking up, but I thought she was fantastic. Okay, so it's Lara Manzanares. I can't, I can't pronounce it. But there's her, and check this out. CD Baby, go ahead and pause the video and go to this and you can download her album because awesome. There you go. <laughs> Thanks for watching that.